Hi everybody, and welcome to today's Elevate Tours by Diesel Juicy Hotel Tour. Today's hotel is going to be the Quality Inn in Knoxville, Tennessee. We are staying here and we are in room 221, I believe. These are the vending machines right here. And you get to ride up this really neat elevator to go to your room. It's a Montgomery. Exterior Corridor Hotel. And here we are at room 221. RFID locks. It is nice and warm in here. As you enter the room to your right, you have the PTAC unit, which has a thermostat inside the unit, a Premier, a little workstation right there. This is a two double bed room and the price of this room with tax was $68, which is a good value. So now we're going to look around this room. Before we do anything, look at these old light switches. This is really cool. This property used to be a Hampton Inn back in the day. So let's take a look at the microwave and fridge. They actually defrost this one. So this is good. And the microwave is clean. LG flat screen TV. You have a dresser here with drawers. So if you stay for a few days, you have a place to put your clothes. And this is the closet. Look at this, it's like a wardrobe style closet. In the bottom, you have a safe, iron, and ironing board. This is back in the days of adjoining rooms. And like a lot of these exterior corridor hotels, the bathroom is in the back of the room. You have ample light for shaving here. <clears throat> Here's your amenities. Coffee maker and hair dryer. And let's take a look at how clean the toilet is. The toilet is clean. And here is the shower. It's a bathtub and shower. And we are going to check the water pressure to see how this does. As with a lot of these older hotels, the water pressure is very good. Here's a view of the two beds. You have a phone and a alarm clock with a charging station. No, it's not flickering. That's the camera refresh rate. Have a Bible and an actual phone book in there. Now we're going to take a look at the beds. Hold the camera and I am going to see how comfortable it is. It's actually very soft. I wouldn't say pillow top soft, but it is not very firm. And at this point now, the bed's comfortable, but is it clean? Underneath the sheets, that's probably came off me. No, that's in there. Let's see here. Now we're going to look underneath. This is where it gets really nasty sometimes. I do not see any hairs under oh. here. There's some stains, but they've been washed out. Oh, and there's <laughs> right there. Yeah, there's some stains, but no hair. It's not the cleanest bed. This is not the worst, but not the best I've seen. Now let's check this bed. Sheets are clean. 
This one is. This one actually looks better. Totally clean. Yeah. Totally clean. No now, there's a little, now there's one right there. It's very faint. The thing is, as much as these beds are used, the mattress covers are always going to have some form of staining on them, probably. But this is not a bad hotel. No. Not bad at all. Let me just cosmetical things. One other thing I pointed out on the way here, there's a, there's a nice hole in the shade here, but that's not too bad. And there was a stain on the wall over there too. Just nothing real major though. Where, show the stain on the wall. Yeah. This wall is a little dirty. So there's that stain there. But I will say this, for $60 a night, this is not bad. Uh, it's not the best place, not the worst place, but if you're looking just for a cheap place to crash in Knoxville, this is definitely a place I could recommend. So with that being said, I hope you enjoyed this hotel tour. Diesel DC out. A huge thank you to all of my patrons for your support of Elevate Tours. The video's over. But it doesn't have to be. You can always watch more. And you know what to do. Click the buttons. And don't forget to subscribe and light up that bell. Until next time, bye y'all.